don't have a Linux machine, you can still learn or use the commands from the web. Actually, this is one of the link where we are using. You can use webnl.org. So you can go to this site in Google. In Google, you type this one, webml.org. So, and then you have to give register. Click here, register, give all your IDs and you, you can give username or email ID. This email ID should be valid. So you can use that and give a register. So once you give register, it will register and it will give you a email account verification. If you see, this is the email account verification. So for me, it is already valid. So it, it says invalid. But if you want to do it from the first, you will get a permission. So this is login. Once you login into that, you have to login using a username and the password. Once you give username password, you will get this. So here, you can directly go to the terminal. <coughs> here you have to give the same password, username and password. So that's it. Now we have logged in. So you can see the time where it is logged in. So if you want to know more about the system, what it is, you can give you name. You can try different commands, but actually many permissions will not be there. I will show you commands which has permissions and which doesn't. So this is a Linux version and this kernel is 5.4. So we will see what version of uh, Linux it is. More. You see it is a CentOS 7.9. So this is the uh, version. So you can try different commands ls a time anything user but not uh, user but not with the permissions if, if some will not have permission for example if config see this does not have permission so this is this has a limitation so here itself you can see it is the ip of the system is this one 139 162 and if you see route type the name <coughs> you don't have configuration the ip route so you can see this is the gateway if you see the previous command interface is 80 So it's zero. This is one nine one thirty nine sixty two five dot two one. So this gateway is this. So if you ping, you should be able to ping to that. Actually, permissions are not there. So at least very basic commands you can try with this. You can go to slash. Then you can browse with all the files just to understand the system. All the etc files you can check here. What all possible you can open and check. You can work with Vim. You can create a file. You can whatever you want to do, you can rest try, but with minimal permission. This SH is also working. So you can write, write small scripts and also check. So like that you can explore with this. It's very easy. I'll repeat it once again. Go to webmail.org, webminal.org. So there you have to log in and register. And then you have to click login with the username and password which you have created. Then you have to click terminal. And in terminal you can start working. So these are all the communities. The other sites also you can launch it. Some of the lessons available are also there. You can try, just try all these. This is a lesson one. So here you see, here you can see all the comments. PWD, how to make directly, very, very, very basic comments. So if you are new to Linux, you can use this tool to learn. This is lesson one. So this is password. This is MKDAR. 
to create a directory. You can try this. So this is lesson one. This is lesson two. So the touch is creating a file. So all these commands you can try. 